Well, today, four young people with Down syndrome will be awarded a scholarship to continue their education. WVTM 13's Emma Owen joins us now live from the Galleria where the Jake Pratt scholarship ceremony just wrapped up. Emma, tell us more about this program and how it all got started. Yeah, Lisa, this is such a cool scholarship program. In fact, the ceremony just wrapped up here a few minutes ago. You can see folks still mingling after receiving their awards. Now, this scholarship honors Jake Pratt, the Vestavia Hills high grad who went on to get his post-secondary education through Clemson Life. He now works for UPS, which helped start this scholarship in his honor. And these funds giving young people with Down syndrome the chance to participate in training programs that prepare them for the workforce and beyond. I went to Clemson Life. Um, in South Carolina, um, in Clemson Life, we um, did cooking classes, learning, manage money, and we go grocery shopping. Important life skills students like Pratt will get to obtain as well as Amy Hyde. Pratt's sister explains this year's recipients are actually uh, contri are continuing their college career. This means they have anywhere from one to three years under their belts already. And Hyde says these awards will reduce the financial burden families of children with Down syndrome often face. So a lot of times um, they do not necessarily save for post-secondary plans and there are just limited scholarship opportunities out there. Um, they don't qualify for traditional loans because the programs are typically more geared towards life skills. So since they don't qualify as a traditional degree, they don't qualify for traditional loans.